Today's cover song slash tutorial slash lesson is Stevie Wonder's I Wish. I'm going to show you how to play it on the ukulele. This song is in E flat minor. Okay, E flat minor. So, before we get to play it, please click on that red square in the bottom right corner to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more covers, tutorials, lessons, and original music. Here's the bass line. You can see it's on two strings. The second string, which is the C string, and the third string, which is the E string. I'm going to show you how to play the bass line, or the bass line part, on the C string first. Here's what we do, the easiest part. We play C, then we play D flat, first fret, then we play D, second fret, then we play E flat. Why? Because it's E flat minor. Third fret, so watch. Open, one, two, three. Open, one, two, three. Open, one, two, three. Okay? Right? Okay, now the part on the E string. Third string. We're going to start on second fret, which is G flat. Then we're going to put our finger on the fourth fret which is A flat. Then we're gonna put our finger on the sixth fret, which is B flat. Notice they're on every other fret. Two, four, six. Two, four, six, four. Two, four, six, four. Now you can use one finger if you want, whatever. But I like to spread them out. play that fourth fret or A flat the second time, I go to the second string and go C, one, two, three, thump, 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 thump. Stop for a while. Slow the video down. You don't have to go this fast first. All right? In case you're wondering, this is at 98 beats per minute. If you have a metronome. All right, now the melody. sign of that part together now. All right? Here's the next part. 
pre-chorus. Most of it's on that E string, some's on the C. They're all the same notes. Listen to it again. Start on the first fret, which is F. Then, right, G, A flat, G, F. Remember that one? That's right, E flat, F. So, then again chromatic. So, fourth, three, four, five, six. So, and then back to this part that I just showed you. Now the chorus. that chorus, it's 2, 4, and 6 again on the E string. So look, 6, 4, 6, 2, 6, 6, 4, 2, 4, 6, 4, 2, 4, 5, 6.
important part at the end. I am going to show you how to play it. It's going to be on the A string. So it starts here. On the 5, 7, 8, ninth fret. Ready? Watch. Then again. Third time. Fourth time. Then you know what? It goes back to the chorus. That's it. You don't need a keyboard to have a drum loop to try it. But you know what? Try it. Good luck with it. Have fun.